Hi everyone, today we're going to be doing thrown simple bowl forms. Taking a nice piece of clay, centering it on the wheel head. I'm taking my hands and coning the clay to get rid of all of that unevenness into the tip of the center. And then we're going to press down to get that nice end centered. Getting rid of any residual clay on the side. Getting that nice mushroom shape and centering the clay. I'm using my dominant hand to get a nice flat surface. Using my thumbs, I'm going to press down to the center of your cl the clay to get a nice opening to about a quarter of an inch from the bottom to a half an inch because I will be trimming these. Using my sponge where my hands are formed, I'm going to open that bottom of the bowl creating that nice curvilinear angle because that's ideal for bowl shapes. Compressing the rim, you can see that that's got that nice curve. From here, I'm now going to start to throw up the walls, adding some more moisture, and I'm not going to interrupt the clay on the inside of that nice curve, but pressing more of the throwing from the outside. And then when I get a little bit higher up, I start to press the clay out. It is ideal when you are throwing bowls to press more outward with that inside hand to create that bowl shape. This is a half sphere bowl form which is ideal for soup, ice cream, cereal, things that need to be scooped. So bowls need to have a nice, beautiful, rounded interior. So here you can see that I am compressing that inside shape. I'm taking my chamois, my plastic chamois, and compressing my lip to get a nice, beautiful form. Now I'm getting my undercutting tool to cut off any residual clay that's unwanted. cutting that away as I go. And then I'm going to take my wire tool and I'm going to cut underneath the form and cut off any of that excess clay which will create an ideal circular area for me to trim the bowl tomorrow when it becomes leather hard. Adding water to the surface, undercutting to get that to be released. And then using my fingers, I'm going to undercut the form and then lift it off. Thank you for watching.